wheelchair. We've travelled on a bumboat on the green South China seas, seen papaya, dates and coconuts in crotches of the trees, and in hawker centres, Singapore keep quietly policed, eaten hundred-year-old eggs and fish brains wrapped in bamboo leaf. We've seen coolies who sold goat's milk and the men who plundered them, while the ghosts of Morm and Coward haunt the new Raffles Hotel. But the most surprising feature of the perils we have passed is you've travelled in a wheelchair with your left leg in a cast. Most people would have had more sense, but we were both surprised to find it rather soothing. And one day we surmised, you needed an attention that I hardly ever pay, while I enjoyed the knowledge that you couldn't get away. Now the generator flickers far inland in Kampuhan, and we lie inside our cottage, cooled remotely by a fan, or take a bath among the ferns and tall hibiscus trees. Green rice grows in the paddy fields. We pick the coffee beans, and outside, parked and ready, sits the chair that takes you round to explore in a contentment that we've only rarely found.